Guys, we got Craig Cameron out there in the uh, pen, and Craig is big on this two-man method of training a horse, and he's big on this flag, you know, this red flag. Uh, this red flag is everything. Matter of fact, when it comes to Craig Cameron, his saddle pads is everything, his halters is everything, his bits. I like Craig, but I, I just don't prefer this method of training horses. You know, uh, first of all, I think that that flag, you know, you don't want to push a horse around with the flag. In my opinion, you know, he's out there turning the horse with the flag. And if his man on the on on the back of the horse is if he's not actually cueing that horse then he's not teaching that horse to ride and pay attention to the reins the bit he's chasing him around with this flag you know i want my horse not to run from waving objects so to me you kind of teaching something that you don't want later down the road, you know. Uh, I don't want my horse thinking that it has to be another person out in the pen to navigate. There's always more than one method to skin a cat. And minds are just more practical. You know, I mean, you hear Craig Cameron a lot of times, if you guys watch him, he's out there making a some kind of weird noise with his mouth. I mean, why not move the horse with a kiss or a cluck? Why not communicate with him that way? That's normally how, I mean, that's the universal communication with a horse all over the world kiss or a cluck so why not use that if you're gonna chase your horse around with something why not pop him with a buggy whip but a flag no, I'm just not I'm just not up on that. I'll be starting a young horse soon, and I'll show you guys how I like to start a young horse. But but running him around with that flag is just not where it's at to me. Uh, getting in a crouching position like a like you're some kind of predator. I just don't believe in that. You know, just teach the horse. If I want my horse to move, I shouldn't have to crouch all down and stalk up on him like a lion or something. You know, if I'm jumping and flinching at my horse like that, do I want him to jump around or do I want him to stand still? So one minute he wants him to stand still with the flag and the next minute he wants him to run away from the flag. I just think that flag is a bunch of BS. And I tell you guys all the time, I don't advertise myself to be the best. I think I'm pretty good at what I do. And I think my methods of what I do is just more practical. I'll get back at you guys later, but I, I just don't get that flag. I think he ought to put a white flag on it and just surrender it. 